Renewable energy is transforming our world. But what about the industries that aren't as glamorous? Shipping moves 90% of global trade, spewing out nearly 1,000 metric tons CO2 per year, which is 3% of global CO2 emissions. Could nuclear power be the surprising answer to cleaning up this vital industry? Alternative fuels like hydrogen and ammonia are promising, but they're not the whole picture. Nuclear power offers insane efficiency in near zero emissions, aligning perfectly with international environmental goals and the International Maritime Organization's EMO ambitious targets to slash greenhouse gas emissions from shipping. Nuclear-powered ships aren't new. The U.S. Navy's impeccable safety record with its nuclear fleet stands as a testament to the technology's reliability. The cargo vessel Sevmorput is powered by a KLT-40M nuclear reactor that drives a single steam turbine engine. Nuclear reactors use fission to generate heat, which creates steam to turn turbines and propel the ship. Molten salt reactors are a game changer, offering higher efficiency and less waste. MSRs operate at high temperatures, around 700 degrees Celsius, enabling easy refueling with liquid fuel. This eliminates the need for long-term reactivity margins, reducing the risk of criticality accidents like Chernobyl. The molten salt remains liquid even at 1,400 degrees centigrades, far above operating temperatures, and solidifies if it cools below 459 degrees centigrades, trapping fission products within the salt. These features enhance safety and reduce the need for complex active safety systems, leading to economic benefits. Furthermore, using chloride-based molten salts allows for a fast neutron spectrum, enabling the complete elimination of actinides produced during operation. This means that spent fuel from traditional reactors can be reprocessed and used as an energy source, drastically reducing long-lived nuclear waste. Nuclear fuel is incredibly efficient, requiring refueling only once every few years. This drastically reduces fuel costs compared to fossil or even other green fuels, whose prices fluctuate wildly. This predictability is a game changer in a volatile energy market. Nuclear ships don't need frequent refueling stops, saving valuable time in port. They also have less reliance on shore-based infrastructure, increasing operational flexibility. Nuclear propulsion offers a high power-to-weight ratio, allowing ships to carry heavier loads and travel faster. This translates to increased efficiency and profitability. Nuclear-powered engine rooms are surprisingly compact without the need for large fuel storage tanks, air intakes, or exhaust systems. This frees up valuable space for cargo, maximizing revenue potential. Let's be real, nuclear also has security and safety issues. Collisions or accidents may cause radioactive leaks, and there is always a threat of terrorists attacking or hijacking the ship. We need to address public perception, strengthen regulations, and make sure the technology is truly safe and secure. South Korea, China, and even private companies are investing in nuclear-powered ships. Could we see a future where cargo fleets are emission-free, powered by miniature nuclear reactors? What do you think? Is nuclear power the key to decarbonizing shipping? Let us know in the comments. Thanks for watching. Hit subscribe for more deep dives into the tech that's shaping our world.